to learn more about this ginormous book. Lodi with an exclamation point. Boom! Yeah, Randy Caparoso joins us right now. He's the author of this book. See, it's got an exclamation point. <laughs> Lodi! Randy, it's good to see you, my friend. Good to see you, Cody. Thank you. Okay, let's talk about this book. Awesome. This is huge. So How Lodi. long did it take you to write this and put this together? Well, it's actually about 10 years in, in the making because uh, I've been here since 2010 here in Lodi. It took a couple of years to put it together. It it, is, it's over 400 pages with about 450 photographs. That is amazing. 450 photographs. So it's a Bible. Or so yeah, exactly. Yeah. It, it is. Yeah. It is. And if you're into wine, what I didn't realize is this is the America's largest wine region. There should be a giant book about it. Absolutely. A lot of people don't know it, but Lodi grows more acres of grapes than all of Napa and Sonoma County combined. It grows more than all of Oregon State and Washington State combined, plus another 20%. So this is a very big and important wine region. But on the cover here, you see uh, an old vine here, mm -hmm. and I'm standing next to one, an old vine. This is sort of em emblematic of Lodi. This vine was planted 136 years ago wow. and it's still producing fantastic wine connoisseurs all over the world look for wow it's amazing that is amazing uh is there was there some stories in there that really stuck with you that as you were doing this research and you're like this is fascinating history wow one of the stories was uh grapes from this particular vineyard planted in 1886 actually for many many years was packed up in little boxes and sent to home winemakers for maybe a huh. hundred years. They didn't know the value of it. Not until only about 18 years ago, all of a sudden it was discovered, so to speak. And now, and there was a big rush of uh, some artisanal winemakers uh, to get these grapes. So Lodi has sort of come into its own fairly recently, and that's why it needed this book. Uh, it's the first book ever written on the actual vineyards and the soils and the climate and and the history and the people uh, you know that are behind these type of uh, vines. It is fantastic. Where can people get it? They can get this uh, th through uh, a website called kitchensinkopress.com and Cinco is spelled C-I-N-C-O, or they can go down to the Lodi Wine, uh, uh, Wine and Visitor Center here in Lodi and pick up a copy. All right, well, it's stick around. It's very limited, though. Very limited, that's uh, right. You want to get it right now, you better get it because it's very limited. Uh, stick around, you're going to introduce us to some winemakers in the Lodi area coming up next hour. All right, stick around. We got more in the show coming up. Don't go away. Lodi with an exclamation point.